No sign of a man who Chesterfield police say was abducted in front of his business around 6 o'clock yesterday morning. And we've confirmed that the FBI is now involved in the search for 44-year-old Parish Patel, grabbed and thrown into an SUV when he tried to open the Raceway gas station off of Jeff Davis Highway near the Richmond-Chesterfield County line. CBS 6's Joe St. George joins us live from the gas station right now. Joe, you talked to an expert about crimes like this. What did they say about the FBI getting involved? The FBI involvement, Rob, is extremely interesting. Let's set, let's set the scene for you, though, this afternoon. You can see the gas station is open for business. You would have no idea that an apparent crime, an apparent abduction took place here yesterday. As you mentioned, 44-year-old Parish Patel came here, parked his car right where those line of vehicles are, right where that Honda, that Toyota are. That's where his Honda was parked yesterday, got out, and according to an eyewitness who told police, that is when uh, an individual two individuals walked up to him and forced him into a dark colored SUV. As you mentioned, we talked to a local security expert, been in the business for about 30 years, retiring as a local police captain a few years ago. He says by the FBI being involved in this case, it makes it very interesting, very intriguing, and it points to perhaps some more information this hour. That the reports that have already come out and noticed that the FBI was involved in the case, then that's a strong indication that there's probably some other type of motive in addition to just an abduction. The FBI typically is not going to be involved in the case unless there's something like maybe a movement across state lines or else some type of uh, other situation. Now we will have more from that security expert coming up in our later newscast. We did visit with the Patel family yesterday. They are asking for privacy uh, at this hour, but they are going around town, passing out these flyers. They're showing up on various posts all uh, around town. Again, Parish Patel, five foot four, 136 pounds, age 44. We'll be following this uh, throughout the day, providing updates tonight at five and six. But reporting live for now off Jefferson Davis Highway, Joe St. George, CBS 6 News. Rob, I'm going to send it back to you in the studio. Joe, it is a gas station, so I was wondering if there might be any surveillance video that police have of what happened. That's that's a that's an excellent question. Uh, that is what our security expert was saying is the first important step that experts and investigators are trying to figure out if that eyewitness that said that Mr. Parish was abducted is indeed telling the truth. What they did yesterday, and I was here, that's why I know they were looking at the security cameras, not only at the gas station, but also at the next door uh, neighbor, essentially, a truck stop polling camera from there. Again, the first step that investigators are looking at this afternoon is trying to figure out if what that eyewitness said was indeed accurate. They're piecing all of those information uh, together, and uh, hopefully they will lead to some sort of uh, new information coming up in the next couple hours. And if we have that, we will break that news in. Thanks, Joe.